Joshua. Um, I work at United Distributors. Today I'm going to be showing you how to stack a seven-way can base and also an eight-way LNNR or NR base which also stands for bottles. The first thing you want to do when you start picking on our side you would like to come to your label station and sign out your labels. Um, when signing out you only pick up three labels at a time. Um, you would like to find your username in the system, put in your password and you're good to go from there. We'll start. Leaving from where we pick up our pallets, once you get all your pallets and you're ready to pick, you would like to get your label and start your bases. Um, I'm just gonna show you right now what a eight-way base looks like. When stacking your pallet, when pulling from uh, your product, you always wanna pick from the top of your pallet. You never wanna stair pick, which is you know, pulling from a bottom row. Um, also, when you're picking, you would like to switch up your bases. Um, as far as your 323 base, the second eight base that you would want to run is four uh, across, four cases all side by side. Now that we've completed our palette from earlier, I'll just go back over the basis of how everything was formed. Um, of course, when starting, you would like to run the same eight base as you know the uh, bottom two layers. But when you go through a product change, you would also like to break your palette down to a five side, which is the big even half of your palette and your three side, which is for any cases that's gonna throw off how even your five side is gonna be. Um, you would always like to have that because every pallet's not gonna stack the same. And during your stack, you always wanna make your pallet look as pretty as possible and as even as possible until the end. This is the second to last step in our process, which is wrapping. You always wanna make sure your pallets are wrapped tight. So it ensures you know, stability for you traveling with your own pick pallet. And it also provides stability for our drivers. You always want to do everything that you can to prevent damage. And wrap is 90% of it. 